like how do y'all feel about coming into the season? What's looking good? What do you got to work on? I guess first things, Coach. Uh, yeah, let me back up one second. Here with uh, Coach Rick Comedy from uh, Jackson State Tigers. Back in Alabama, what uh, what is it like to be back here? And tell us about the difference in the fan base, just you know, from uh, Tuskegee to uh, Jackson State. Well, you know, people uh, like to say that it's a major difference in fans, but they both love football, you know. And uh, you can't ask, you know, you can't ask more as a coach to have people who really love the game. I mean, that's what I love about both schools. They, you know, the game, and you know, gives them enthusiasm. The game brings. Uh, the, the weekly talk, the game brings uh, good and bad. You know, when you lose, you know, you're, nobody's happy. When you win, everybody's happy. So, you know, uh, people try to different, uh, divide the two teams, and the two, not the teams, but yet yeah, still the, the public and the fans. But people are people. You know, some take it harder than others, as they do in Tuskegee. Others, um, you know, yeah. I, I relate back to uh, Mississippi State when uh, Coach Groom was there and listening to the fans, you know, and people say that our fans are, you know, are hostile, but yet still I heard their fans, you know. So, you know, it's a, you know, it's, it's part of the game. And, um, you know, uh, people identify our fans, I think, you know, poorly than they should. And, uh, but our fans just want to win, and they deserve good football. They're used to good football, and that's what we want to bring. We want to bring good, solid football to Mississippi, Jackson, Mississippi. Uh, speaking to that, obviously the, the fan base is a demanding fan base and the avid fan base. What can they expect to see out of the team this year? Well, I think the consistency, solid, hard-hitting um, guys uh, that go down to the last leg to win, you know, at all costs, you know, and uh, a lot of togetherness um, and um, a lot of passion. And, um, you know, we're strong, you know, we can run, and uh, we got the makeup of a good football team. And so I'm excited about getting started. Getting ready to go into uh, practice for the fall, start in you know, August. Mm -hmm. What are the things coming out of spring that you see that you need to work on? What are some areas of improvement? Um, just uh, consistency and making sure we shore up our special teams. And I think they're the two things that I want to work on is making sure that we're consistency, teamwork, you know, and, and um, pride is a and, and just overall pride in units, you know, playing your role, playing your role with pride. And um, that's what I'm after. I think when we do that and everybody plays their role with pride, mm -hmm. you'll come out a winner. Football is the ultimate team sport, but who are a couple individuals we can look for to stand out this year? Well, I got one over here and, and Chris and one over here and Sam. I think those guys will want to give everything they got. And uh, when we got uh, Kerry Hoskins at free safety. Uh, we got some great corners and Anthony Johnson and uh, Jaleel Johnson. Uh, you know, we can play that corner and, you know, we – you know, we're, you know, I think we're strong up, uh, up front, you know, especially when the defensive line will be tough. I think our offensive line will be tough with Tylen Boudreaux, who was supposed to be here, along with Colson at center. You know, I think uh, we'll be, um, you know, across the board with Eric Williams, a at, at left, at left tackle who's really come on. He's about 6'8", has come on and brought his game on. And uh, I'm excited. I'm real excited because I feel their passion. I feel their pain from a season ago and going into this season with a, with that little bit of bitterness that you need, you know, like, okay, we'll be quiet about it. We'll be quiet. You got us. Okay, you got that win last year. Okay, let's, let's throw it. Here we go. You know, let's throw again. You know, and I like that. Okay. Is there any one particular game that you've got circled on the calendar this year? Um, all of them. My, not the big round circle. Okay. Know, so, uh, <laughs> no, there's no small circle. Good deal. Okay. All right. Thanks, Coach. Thank you.